Good evening, everybody, and welcome to Chris Cast. It is the big one. It's the grand final tonight. It's the ETF 12 Highlander Spring 2023 final. It's the Premiership division, of course. It is going to be the best of the best, the best Europe has to offer. We're going to have the defending champions, SDCK, ready to defend their title again. And they're going to be facing twice. We've been in the final before, but will this be the season? But they come up top trumps and take the crown. We'll have to wait. As you can see, I'm joined by an array of talent tonight. Casting me, we, we uh, casting with me will be Godfather, and uh, we also have an analyst desk with the biggest brains we could uh, find at short notice. Um, we have Dave and we have Harry who are going to offer their insight on the uh, the games in between the rounds and uh, let you guys know what they think and who they think is going to win. If anyone's going to know who's going to win, it's going to be these guys. I love how when you mentioned the word hero earlier, Godfather, Jackie Legs entered the server. I was summoning him. Yeah, that was yeah, me. yeah. I heard I need a hero playing like in my head at that moment. Like yeah. the Shrek 2 version. I obviously. need a hero. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's going to be SCCK in the blue. They're going to be attacking first. Trying to set a time. It is going to be best of three on upward. Um, and then twice we try to beat that time when we swap around and uh, often you know, the early kills set the play and Set the pace of how the rest of the round is gonna go. We'll have to see as it's pretty calculated here Godfather No major uh, no major Ooh. things happening yet. There's gonna be the first debt taking the sniper down uh, Getting that crit, crit trap dead. Uh, we got a soldier jumping up onto playground, forcing broken up now CJ the one thing that we didn't mention is uh, what sort of time should we be expecting from SDCK on this map? What do you think is going to be uh, an aggressive fast time for them? I mean, rule number one, you never want to see the time hit double figures. You do not want to see 10 minutes, but I think SDCK will not be happy if it's anything slower than sort of seven minutes. They want a fast time uh, with, a, with this kind of map. This is what they love as we see the Uber coming out now, mostly onto Buddy, but it's going to be the counter Uber onto Delta. That Pyro just air blasting away, creating some space, but Buddy is still in, throwing out so much damage there. A lot of damage going down. At least he had very, very weak, but no death. In fact, it's going to be twice with the cleanup. They managed to get five on the side of SCCK, no major players dying other than Sammy, no demo and no soldier for twice. It's going to be difficult for the repush here, Godfather, but that was pretty well held. Pretty well held. They did get the gun. They did get the teleporter. So it's going to be a little slow for twice to get back in and this heavy ready to peek the corner. Gunning down Delta. He picks up the pack, just narrowly staying alive. Broken's going to pick up Likey and now Jackie Legs falling to the heavy. And uh, I like a little bit of flank action happening from Buddy right now. Delt doing his best. To, uh, to hold it off, and that gun, just level 2, pretty weak, the Engineer retreating, and up goes uh, the Medic, running up that hill, doing his best to stay alive. He's actually going to recommit CJ, just barely holding on to this point. Yeah, that's risky. I was saying like it was almost like a slow but sure pincer movement coming in from SCCK, just slowly taking the round, going in and in and in. They were so passive there twice, but it's worked out to their benefit because they've got those players live. They still have an Uber. The Uber's going to come in onto Buddy again and again. It's going to be the counter Uber onto Dell. A much, much better Uber by about 20%, just air blasting people away. But a lot of players are just out of position for twice now. There's only a level one century left. Oh, Hyver Sebastian, the destruction, he goes down. CJ. The absolute Buddy just nuke. goes huge. Huge there, pushing up the hill. Sebastian is going to go down as does most of twice, and SDCK gets that first point in 220. That's the thing that happens. It was looking so good for twice. They were just committing for the second uber there things were in their control but then on the retreat they just lost a little bit of position and as soon as broken went down they had no sniper superiority like he was able to do what he wanted and then buddy just going in and nuking look at this forward hold on the second point i don't think twice are going to be able to come out there 40 percent disadvantage right now in terms of uber and seck have just got control hiver into the skybox oh, body shot. oh but axio gets Kedu. This is the exact sort of play I was looking for out of the pick glasses. You gotta be a hero here, and uh, the spy will get the medic, so it's gonna be big ad for twice, but look, they are already forced all the way out as this cap comes through. So it's gonna be big ad for twice, trying to hold on to third. CJ, uh, I mean, whose fault was that stab, or was it just really good play from Axia? I think Axia has just been popping off in this final so far. Like, on that first point, he was getting multiple kills. 
um, as we see a reflect kill from Garden Fungus onto Hiver there. Uh, SCTSK was just responding in that perfect way. Losing your medic? Okay, let's go forward. Let's get some frags. Let's trade. Um, and they managed to get so many people. And you can just see consistently they're getting kills. Here comes the defensive Uber there. Menex on the chase onto Gedu. Gedu is trying to run away, but no, May is there to protect. Not getting Gedu down. And once again, just look at twice. They have players, but they're at uber disadvantage. They've only got a level one sentry. They were just in no position to defend this Godfather. They're just complete control from STCK on this corner right now. Yeah, we saw uh, Sandburn, who's uh, incorrectly tagged as Apple, I think, for me right now. So that might be a confusing moment for me in future. But uh, he was playing really far forward there, gets taken down. Made a little bit of space for STCK, though. They keep this cart rolling up the hill. Uh, Axio looking to stop it, and May actually catches him by accident. This gun, only level one, the Uber's gonna come in, the, the bombing demo gets stuffed pretty hard, but SGCK somehow, even with the Uber getting pretty far to stop, makes a lot of space, Sammy goes down, and uh, now Buddy's just going deep! He's gonna go down as he craters onto those stairs, and uh, Mezzo versus Broken, the 1v1, who's got it? The melee's are out! And Broken gets the kill. <laughs> Uh, just barely hanging on to his life there, but 433 through 3, CJ is maybe not the fastest I've ever seen, but certainly a very quick pace. Yeah, I would say this is like the first, not mistake, but misplay from SCZK. They didn't really need to use that Uber there. That third point was pretty much guaranteed. They had this huge, huge Uber advantage. They could have maybe just gone in deeper with it and tried to catch the medic out. They don't. That means they're a disad now. They're slowly catching up. And of course, it doesn't matter that much. Like I said, it's not really a mistake because it does mean that cart needs to be pushed all the way before any meaningful trade can happen. But look at this passive hold. Sebastian, Sammy, Elysina, they're all on the really passive side. As the Uber comes in onto Buddy, he has to jump forward to try and get anything done. And it's going to be an Uber onto Menex to try and counter in main. Can't really achieve anything, though. He's got no one for support. Has to back away to the spawn. Twice are just giving up so much space here. A lot of space given up. Even more taken. Uh, I mean, STCK plays so cleanly in terms of if you give them an inch, they'll take a mile. And they're taking a lot of space here. They got the heavy down below trying to just lay down that fire. Unfortunately, the cart gets stopped, but only one alive, the medic. And this will be STCK almost certainly getting in here as it's a sniper med pushing the cap through. That is 6.07. I think you were talking about a seven minute time being what they were looking for. Uh, 6.07, a minute faster than that. Only a slow first. Everything else pretty darn fast from SDCK. Yeah, they'll be very happy with that. Um, twice, maybe, you know, if the copium is running high, they're saying it could be worse. Honestly, I'm not really sure what happened on that last point. What, Whether it was too much respect being shown to SCCK or whether it was fair because like I mentioned not the mistake or the misplay whatever word you want to use SCCK used that uber on third and achieved nothing with it they already had that cap down it was a bit of a wasted uber it was you know just used and, and didn't really achieve anything other than making sure twice backed out but on last twice had that advantage they got the uber they had an uber advantage but they stayed passive they stayed on their spawn and if they had a little bit more courage, they had a little bit more faith in themselves. And like I said earlier, when we were talking about, you know, what do they need to do to win this final? They need to take those risks. They need to make the big plays. Go forward and retake that forward hold. Fight it. Maybe Uber out through main and try to catch them out. Sitting back passive just allowed SCCK to say, okay, we're going to build our Uber and then we're going to go in with all this space you've given us. So um, kind of a big ask for twice now on their attacking phase. For everyone at home, look at this likey sniper spot. If you haven't used this in pubs before, you will want to. On defense, getting up on the high ground, getting a nice sight line to use there. And, uh, you know, really, uh, really good stuff there. Buddy gets two uh, with his traps, just slowing things down, but it's upward first. Things don't really uh, get interesting until you see the sack go forward. And with a couple players getting pretty weak, it'll be slow and steady for now. Uh, actually, a lot of space being taken by Buddy there. He gets a kill onto Axio in the tracks area. Uh, as now, it looks like the Uber might be coming out in a second. It is going to be in. Uh, Sammy and Delt going forward, doing their best, but getting absolutely nothing, taking no space. SDCK's Uber going to be a little better here, and it will be about even for the next one. I don't know, CJ. That was just a, a real poor Uber from Twice, I think. Yeah, and the thing is, it's... 
it's not necessarily a poor Uber, it's the fact that SCCK responds so much more aggressively. Look at where Sandburn is right now. Like this upper area where you see the small health pack, the little chocolate bar, that is where you want to control. And when SCCK were pushing, that is where Buddy was. He was going forward and saying, hey, I want to take this space. But when they're going forward now, Sammy and Delt are just being pressured out by the fact that Sandburn and Buddy are just saying, no, this is still our spot. We're defending, but we're still controlling this area. And without that high ground, they're not able to do much because of the aggression on the defense. As Samba, there you go. Again, being aggressive takes Danny Lissi now, winning that heavy fight. Yeah, winning not just the fight, but taking a bit of space back there as well. I mean, two down for both sides right now. Axio doing his best to hide. Oh, I wanted to decloak right now. He's right by the medic. The Uber's going to be popped out, though, and he's going to get caught. This Uber exchange again. Getting almost nothing for twice, and at some point soon it's going to be unpushable. I mean, 4.13 left to go. They haven't even capped first. Axie is going to be getting behind here, doing his best to maybe get a decloak. That gun's still alive, doing its best to just keep things down. Oh, there's the gun going down. A nice decloak there, but the buddy 5k CJ, I think, is really what's keeping uh, SDCK in here. Yeah, we see the conch coming out. Jackie Legs loves using this conch just to push forward, get his team to reclaim that space. And again, they're forward. They're just trying to get stuff down. Uh, it's still equal Ubers with no ops. Curse of the caster. I say it's equal Ubers. And then Likey comes in and domes Sebastian. -y. Huge Uber ad for Getty right now. It's going to be 85% by the time Seb gets back into the action. And you know what? This it's crit, CJ. It's crit. This is what I was going to say. Like, the panic is going to start getting in. The frustration is start getting in. This is, you know, you don't have a great time defending, and now you can't push first. Twice need to start taking some risks. Maybe crits is the answer. Oh, SDC Gay is going to just take this so aggressively. Can Buddy hit his pipes? Sebastian's one health, and he's going to get the respawn just in time. Oh, unlucky for Buddy there, but with so little time on the clock, twice just fumbling to get forward here. Gonna go with the crits as already mentioned. Axio looking for the decloak, trying to sap the gun. Oh, he gets caught immediately by the pyro. Doesn't get the sap or any kills. Like he's gonna get broken. Both pick classes down for twice as SDC can't continues. Their dominant hold, Jackie Legs jumping forward. He's getting some space for his team as well. And at some point soon, again, there's not gonna be time to push. And really what I'm looking for, already looking ahead, is uh, can twice keep their mental intact, but look, Chris coming out and getting the med. That'll be good for their mindset as they find almost a full wipe, CJ. Almost a full wipe. And you know what? 220 on the clock. Um, I don't know. Someone get their calculator out. I used to know a couple of players who knew second by second if anything was possible. Sammy already trying Copy to storm count. Three. Yeah, you need times three all the way at this point, and uh, you need no mistakes. You need SCCK to crumble oh. on every point, but they lose Dell. It's going to be the conch. Oh, it all falls apart. They were so good there. One thing, interesting difference between North America and European Highlander action is that I see a lot more conch over here. Uh, also, Buddy finding the medic yet again. Um, back in NA, you see a lot more uh, battalions back up, and so the conch here, slightly different approach to taking the post Uber fight and uh, opting for that healing rather than the, you know, flat damage reduction. Uh, I don't know. Do you think Conch is the right call or would you like to see a bats backup? I think Conch is just really good. I just think the speed, the health, like everything just really, really helps here. Um, I don't want to say it's over, but they really needed SCCK to crumble on every single point there and they couldn't even kind of spawn camp as the Uber comes out. I think this round is pretty much going SCCK's way. Um, so this is kind of dead time, Godfather time for uh, twice to maybe think what they're going to do next round. Like, what's the plan here? How are they going to overcome this? Because the amount of time it took to crack first, uh, you need to do a lot better than that. Yeah, you really got to uh, be taking it a bit more aggressively and, and cleanly to get in and uh, get the space you need, get the cart all the way up as needed. It is uh, officially dead time in my book, 30 seconds on the clock. Uh, a quick shout out, Hungry Most Wanted for the sub, much appreciated. Uh, but CJ, looking at this, uh, I think it's just on twice to have the mental reset. They're going to be able to push first next round and they've got to get a good time and, and just have that mental reset. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, 
they need to think like the worst thing they can do now the worst thing they can do now is say you know we're not going to win upward let's let's talk about the next map because there's still like you can still come back from this you can still win um on upward it's best of three you can still win the next two rounds but they need to do something drastic going crits on first there seemed to be the answer is that what they're going to rely on when they attack this round no they need to say what was going wrong why did we lose every single time we traded uber there why did we lose every single every single time we tried to go in and sack I and mean, it looks like godfather oh. we are readying up straight away i actually, actually want to hear uh, a quick explanation from the desk what was wrong uh in each of those uber exchanges why did they lose every time they went for the exchange uh do you want to go first or do you want me to uh, i was just i was just gonna say the the thing for me would be why are you even going to an uber exchange as your first port of call you know you've got this this setup you you know how stck set up they set up aggressively on this first point they didn't make any attempts uh sack wave they didn't make any attempts trying to pick the heavy sunburn who was playing aggressively i think they were they were just relying on that uber trade to work and because it didn't work for them they had no other answer other than crits yeah um the main the main difference on the first holds was the pressure onto the sniper like he was not getting pressured at all got picked once or twice but other than that he wasn't getting any pressure so he was just free to just headshot 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 and that meant the post was just so bad for twice um and whereas uh, Broken was getting pressured all the time. Even if he wasn't dead, he wasn't necessarily shooting anything. There you have it. Uh, CJ, it's twice his turn to make a push. Uh, what is the uh, the key here? What are they going to be trying to do as we get into half number two? Well, I mean, if they have, you know, the the same thought process as Dave there, I think he's absolutely hit the nail on the head. Like, getting rid of that heavy. Sandburn being allowed to be that aggressive on the high ground is just unforgivable because it means you cannot get your pyro and your demo up there to spam down. Um, so maybe they need to start working on going for some snipes, going for some stabs onto Sandburn. Um, it does look like they've got Seb out quite early here. Um, so no kind of... Uh, that kind of sack wave, it looks like Buddy's really, really weak. He does go down, so that's demo down. That should be the catalyst for them to go forward and maybe go for a beneficial trade. Uh, they're thinking about it. They don't have a missing oh, yet, but it's going to be the Uber. Shot. It's going to be the Uber and Lakey hitting a very nice shot onto Broken as well. Saw that POV. Um, this Uber, this Uber exchange getting very little, but Lakey just continues to pop up there. He finds four be before he finally goes down. A little tongue twister there, but... Uh, Twice needs to take some uh, presence here. Gotta get that pyro forward. Try to chase down that medic if you can. Is there a soldier to bomb? There is not, so that medic will escape. But S uh, SDCK now out to second. Oh! Wait, I didn't even see Seb die. How did that happen? Yeah, he uh, got taken down May just going forward and just, uh, you know, just doing that thing that scouts do, hitting the meat. A um, couple of meat shots going down and that's that's such a blemish on twice there they, i was just gonna say look they've done so well they've pushed first 120 really really good but losing your medic to a scout just running in it's not what you want to be doing at this level of play you really want to have a little bit more protection onto your medic there um so it's put them in a situation where now they have to kind of reset they know they have a disad as the uber's going to come in from SCK. they're getting extremely aggressive trying to catch players out um, but it's we're not working out for them, Godfather, because Broken is popping some heads. Broken's going to pop heads if you give him any space to do so. I want to see a bit more pressure onto that sniper, but uh, twice working their way up this hill. Very aggressive gun, CJ, uh, from Clark. It's going to get taken down now. A spy plate going forward. Axio doesn't find anything. He'll get flamed down. A lot of uh, heart push already here, but twice his combo struggling to retake that space that was made beforehand. Dad, you just narrowly dodging sniper shots time and time again. Broken will find May instead. So this fight rotates around. That's the Uber coming out. It's just going to be onto this heavy. Now you got Sammy to work their way forward, but it's only 80% for SDCK, and now it is full ad. And uh, yeah. I don't know. That's kind of a failed push there, CJ. It's an opportunity wasted. They had this Uber ad. They could have gone in, got some stun. As it looks now, Sammy's going to get heated up by this Uber. Seb is trying to run away. Mezzo takes down Broken, and he's lurking behind. 
Um, oh, they're between a rock and a hard place here, Seb, in these side tunnels. Um, it does look like a lot of kills are going their way. Um, looking at that, players are dead for SCCK. Buddy and Samba, that's a lot of HP and damage off the field right now. And Sebastian E living through all of that means there is an uber advantage. So it's kind of another throw at the dice here. Um, that wasted opportunity as Mezzo gets the backstab onto Sammy. He gets another crucial kill after living earlier on. And again, it's just going to slow their push, Godfather. They have this ad, but again, they don't have a demo to go forward with it. I mean, one point in 120. Uh, that's a minute faster than we saw SDCK do it, if I remember correctly. And yet, Twice is now just getting stalled here on second by SDCK's defense. They've got Sandburn going down into tunnel, trying to kill this soldier. It's a 1v1, and the heavy will win it. Now getting rushed at by a scout, so a bit of a, a flank fight. As the Ubers are exchanged, the Pyro doing his best to stop. Medic up in the air, maybe back down to tracks. But SDCK winning the fight so cleanly, that entire kill feed going in their favor as it's almost a wipe. I just SDCK cannot be broken here by Twice's offense. Uh, it's it's rough to watch when you consider S, uh, sorry Twice had that uber advantage. They had a bit of a fail uber push. They kind of got another chance by surviving the SCCK Uber. They have the advantages. They lose Sammy. They don't want to push without their demo, despite having this huge advantage. They wait, they wait, they wait, giving time for SCCK to get the Uber. And then there's an Uber trade in which they pretty much get wiped. So um, SCCK is showing that they really, really do like this map. And they're showing how strong they are, even on this second point. And it's just chalking off time. And like I said, the frustration comes in when you're in this situation, when you keep pushing, you keep kind of like bashing your head against the wall. You want to push the point, but then, you know, you get set back, your push gets slowed down, your push gets delayed, and it gets frustrating. And this time, you know, last time we saw Chris being pulled out, Sebastian at 97%, he's getting pressured, uses that Uber. And it's going to be better be here difference. for twice, CJ. They need to get on together. They're going to get one. Sammy needs to find this. Oh, no, and the spy gets him in the end. What a play there by Axio. He'll die for it, but that is what they needed the hero play that's gonna be rhetoric that i keep repeating i'm watching Bezo right now speaking of heroes he gets uh, spotted out and will not wait not spotted out okay <laughs> <laughs> he somehow was not spy checked at all in that and then dead rings away uh, that just reminds me of like down. a hitman game you know like when you yeah, just yeah. put a disguise on they're like no no that guy's legit don't worry yeah he's <laughs> totally fine it's not the same bald man here's a big bomb from jackie like she's trying to get behind getting some high ground spam in and oh absolutely deleted uh, he mentioned he hates air blast and that's exactly why two lives in a row i believe jackie legs has been uh killed by his own rocket so shout out to delt for uh dealing that killing blow time and time again yeah 533 is not great for the first two points despite how well they did on that first point the second point can be held well as we've seen but generally the third and last point are the areas that you get the most time for your defense so uh twice definitely not looking at a great time at the moment but that doesn't mean it's over they could get these next two points quickly there's still a lot to go here uh, but look at this aggressive sentry from clark um just watching the the slope there just not allowing any space this is what i was talking about earlier godfather on last twice just gave so much space and respect and this is what ssk are not doing they're saying you want to take this oh he picks up seven that is a med drop sorry to interrupt cj but what a shot there and uh that basically halts blue's push but they're still getting forward here and that's gonna force out the medic sdck trying to take this aggressively forward they're only gonna pick up a few uh but a 7k out of the heavy right now defensively uh, he is holding on to that high ground and uh, that is another hold i don't actually see a heavy i just see a giant chicken uh, at the moment so uh I think Full Moon is allowing some interesting cosmetics oh, to the be Buddha's used. Out. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, running the old chicken Kiev there, um, but does go down there. Axio gets the backstab, so that kill streak is over um, for the heavy, and maybe some space here. Bit of a more passive sentry from uh, Clark here, only level two. And uh, look at the space on the cart right now. Twice starting to get their players into position. Maybe Broken has an angle soon enough. There is going to be an Uber for Sebastian. It's going to be Clips. Can it be big? It needs to go big, but no, SGCK had in time, and as any uh, caster will tell you, Uber into crits is always going to be better. Here's Jack's up in the air. Oh, what a deletion. 
he goes down to Sammy there. And uh, Mikey continuing to just absolutely delete people. Jackie Likes himself is, uh, you know, shocked by that kill. <laughs> yeah, he says you rolled me. I uh, wasn't expecting that. Look, I, I love the uh, the idea. I love, you know, we talked about taking risk, going crits there. But the thing with crits is it either needs to be a big surprise or it needs to be perfectly executed. And uh, it just seemed that SSK got that Uber in time. So, yeah. Um, things they, looking they have it here. That's going to be bigger, I think. If they can get forward, it's 80%. Oh, but the kite from STCK, they're just going to give a lot of room there. They're happy to give up the cart. And now keep their full Uber. So it's, uh, where is the demo sitting? He's setting some traps uh, back in tiles right now. Just watching that area. Sammy's going to be peeking. Spots the traps. Going to move them away. But Likey, a nice clean shot. You can't stand still to clear those traps. De oh, oh, Delta almost goes down to the debt. CG, I want to see an aggressive play here. Oh, that is the force that I wanted from uh, twice and no more Uber and still keeping the crit streak in hand is twice. Yeah, like, you know what? They, they're trying something here. They're cooking. You know, they managed to get Clark down. So building a sentry on last wasn't possible. And that enabled the sack to go in and actually get the force. And at the moment with this crit, I want to see them do something interesting with it. I'm trying to see what they may be planning. But the thing is, SCK are aware now. They know what's going to be coming. They're playing extremely passive. Here comes the sticky. It's going to get likey. That sentry goes down as well. The dispenser gets cleaned up. All the big picks. Uh, but it's going to be two backstabs from Mezzo. That slows down the cart. It's not looking too good for SCK right now. In fact, I think twice are going to be able to push this cart in. Oh, but Jackie Lake's the hero! The hero I will never stop talking about. He comes in and he stops it with help from his spy. Mezzo will tilt out. And the point stays alive a little while longer. It's just this scout doing his best. He's underneath. Now the pyro jumping in. Garden Fungus will hold down this cart a little while longer. And twice just cannot get through. And it's full uber for the defense. Broken hitting some shots right now from that window on the high ground. Can they get in the Uber, CJ? It's coming in, it's the demo doing his best, getting onto Delt, and that is an Uber expanded, and still the crits. What do you think of crits? I'm liking the crits, but uh, I still oh, miss, I will miss with the jump stab there. Um, I'm liking the crits. They're trying something. They're trying to shake the boat. They're trying to get something different going on. But for some reason, they did not get the cap there. If they got the cap there, it would have been a very respectable kind of push. And you would have said, you know what? They're trying something different. I like this. But SCCK is just able to claw back just by their fingernails holding on there. And um, now it's in a really tough situation because they have to make this crits land. I think this is just Jackie Lex's world. And we're... Oh, my God. Well, they're not living it anymore. As Sammy's gonna find two, he takes down Gedu. Now you gotta play the cart. Oh, the scout into the pit. And that will be 11.20 to cap for what a slow time, but eventually getting there using the crits. I mean, I, I'm, I'm gonna keep singing the praises of Jackie Likes. He uh, got an extra minute or so for STCK on that last, uh, last hold, just getting good clean rockets in. And uh, twice, they're gonna have to have the hold of their lifetime. Or, uh, yeah, I mean, SDCK is gonna, gonna be setting a pretty fast time based on what we saw first time around. See, when I was playing uh, Godfather, I was often kind of like the, you know, like the spin doctor for my team. You know, I could, I could make any bad situation, like, sound good, right? And, and if I'm talking, you know, to twice right now, that's my team, I say, look, it says 1120, but if we hard hold them on first, we win the game. You know, yeah. that's what they need to do. I mean, yeah, that's you don't have too many options against SDCK. You gotta kind of just go hard, especially in a uh, moment like this. SDCK had those uh, crit traps set. Uh, or, excuse me, Twice has those crit traps set. I need to uh, swap my HUD names here, but uh, what are you expecting to see from this push, CJ? Look, SCCK have so much time to play with here. They can just throw in some sacks. They can play it slow. They can go fast and just go for the trades and hope they win those post Uber fights. They can do whatever they want to do um, because they have a lot of time to play with. They're not really under much pressure right now. Um, so they're probably just going to play it kind of default, see how it goes, and then switch it up depending on how you know the defense comes out. And as it is, you see Gedu staying in spawn. It's not going to be uh, not going to be an aggro push yet. 
No, uh, keeping their medic alive here. Uh, I mean, they have all the time in the world to work with. When they were on offense, they kind of just wanted to go fast and get a really quick time, and they did with a 6.02 or, or so, whatever it was. Uh, but now with 11 minutes to work with, STCK can kind of take this as a leisurely game of TF2. Axio going to go for the stab, get it onto Likey, and uh, here is the bomb from Jackie Legs. He goes pretty darn deep. He and Mezzo... Both behind at the moment, getting run at though by the scout. Jackie Lex will crater! Not what I want to see from the soldier of SCCK. Yeah, I'm not sure what he was trying to do there. Like go in behind and then come in as like a bit of a sandwich, a bit of a pincer movement, but then got caught out by Menex, who was looking for exactly that play. So the cater not really working out too much this time and like i said they have so much time to play with it doesn't really matter if they make some mistakes here jackie going in again uh getting caught out but the sentry does go down the ubers are going to be traded it's much better for twice right now um as you would expect but rambosaur going down no sentry no ng that's going to put a lot of pressure on the other players a whole lot of pressure i mean this is the time now for the bombs to come in but twice smartly backing out do not want to get your med caught there and just have it be a steamroll. The heavy narrowly avoiding death from the sniper. But uh, yeah, with nine, about nine minutes left to go uh, on the clock for SDCK, they will cap first and just get ready to try to bust through SD, uh, twice his second hold. Yeah, I mean, look, again, if I'm trying to spin this, if I'm uh, the twice player, twice Mezzo? leader. Um, Mezzo? Oh, he gets caught out. I'd say, look, this is a really good point to hold. We can hard hold them here. Like, you know, let's just chalk off as much time as we've got two minutes and 20 seconds off from the start. You know, they held first longer than SCCK did. So they're already doing better on their defense at this point. They just need to keep it up. They need to keep just grinding down that time, making it frustrating for uh, SCCK. Don't allow them to roll it. Um, but Sammy going down there is not going to be good. Um, but they are going to trade for Buddy as well. So um, just a little bit of kind of like a little bit of kills here and there. Just going back and forth. Yeah, you're taking it slow and steady until they find a way they really just want to go in with. Mezzo is going to be lurking in the background, expecting him to call some things here. Jackie Legs up in the air, going for the bomb. Gets a good rocket onto Zeb. And actually, that's going to be the force as the scout runs out of tunnel. And uh, the exchange happening. I don't think SCCK needed to use there. But opted to get the exchange and uh, actually Sammy doing a good job getting some space twice, taking back this hill. Yeah, that's really, really good. Axio did an amazing job during that sack wave. Um, Axio got three kills. He takes out a third of the team. And once that Uber gets forced, it's like, hey, we've killed a lot of players already. Let's go forward and make sure they don't have this free Uber to use. It's exactly what you want to do on this point. And that means we're kind of back to where we were before. Sammy is down, so expect SCCK to put a little bit of pressure, knowing that the demo is not in position just yet. But with equal Ubers, you know, twice just need to hold their ground, have a bit of faith with themselves, and start taking some of these fights. But look at the aggression. SCCK is so far forward already. They've got one, two, three kills. As Sammy goes down very weak, oh, he dies. So does Del. What a try fight, CJ, to go in without Uber and just win on DM. Broken. A 5k gets shut down at the end as well. There's not even going to be a sniper here to try to get a cheeky shot. That is just the cleanest DM fight uh, from SDCK. They have this full Uber twice. Luckily, escapes with their medic, but now all the space open for SDCK to get forward here. That is all based on the fact that Sammy was not alive and SCCK realized there's no demo, so we can pressure this with our entire team. They do not fear, they do not like care that there's a sniper alive. They know there's no demo, so they send their entire nine players forward and try to do something. Uber, as they Uber into the corner here. It's going to be this really awkward trade. Hyver and Elysium both going down, and there's not much to counter onto here. Yeah, nothing really committed and then nothing to uh, collapse back onto for twice. That's just an uber exchange. And now Mezzo looking for a play. He's going to dead ringer out and uh, dealt doing a good job not chasing too far. Was vulnerable to a headshot there for a moment, but will survive. Uh, looking at this positioning from SDCK, just playing on this corner as best they can. Good uh, banana or elbow presence right now from the flank of twice playing that corner area and just spamming in as best they can. I, I don't know, twice, they've got six minutes to hold two points. The cart not quite all the way up those tracks. They need to keep this one as long as possible. 
Yeah, but it's going to be really difficult. The cart is already up the first two ramps. It's being pressured up that third ramp now as uh, they do manage to kill May, and that's a lot of players going down for SCCK. They get that Uber, but they're not in a good position to use it. They've got no one really to push with. It's just Sandburn holding the line. But look, this is the position, Godfather. You, if you're a twice player, you should be saying, hey, we just killed a whole bunch of their team. Let's go forward. Let's force them. Let's trade here when it's in our advantage. Let's here. reclaim this slope. Here is the Uber trade going forward. The gun getting taken out. Seb playing very far forward. Gedu completely isolated from his team, but will have about 10% add as now. Oh, good kill there by the soldier onto Buddy. Down goes Blue's demo. But now trading right back out. Sandburn finding three, including the demo, and it's going to be Jackie Legs going so deep here, taking all the space into tiles, getting up, getting that pack, and taking down the opposing soldiers. So. With that point cap, five minutes to hold last year for twice, and Jackie Legs already controlling the tiles area. It is not looking good for twice fans. No, um, I mean, at the end of the day, it's synced up now. There is 4.45 left on the clock, and if the cart isn't pushed in within that time, then twice will win, but that's... That's easier said than done by a big amount. They are getting some kills here, though. Three down so far, and they're holding a bit of a passive hold, but like I said in that previous round, Godfather, this is equal ubers. I want them to be aggressive, and they are. They're going underneath now. They're realizing it's equal ubers. We cannot sit passive like we did in that previous last hold. If we do that, it's basically giving them all the space in the world. So they're holding up top. They're in the uh, the tiled area, and now 100% for both teams. Here comes Buddy. Yeah, Buddy trying to uh, work his way forward, but then the reflect kill from Det will give uh, the Pyro a 5k and the Uber forced out. Seb getting very weak there defensively, so SDCK, despite the cart moving backwards right now, has full Uber, like he hitting a nice shot onto Broken. There's no more sniper to worry about. Seb trying to escape out to spawn as the Uber comes in. Buddy trying to just find any frags right now. He's jumping deep, getting up onto that high ground. He's gonna kill a couple. And May on the cart. Sammy now looking to spam down. He's gonna get Mezzo. Can he get this cart? Someone's got to look at Cart. Oh, Delt is going to jump forward, but now getting gunned down by Sandburn in the high ground. Sammy needs to come forward and try to collapse, but Likey will get him. There's nobody alive right now for twice, and that will be, with three minutes remaining, map number one. <laughs> SDCK just took the space. They held the WK, and it ended up working out for them, really. Uh, it just In that second round, it was from second to third to fourth, it was... They just didn't stop walking forward, took all the space they were given, and uh, twice just not denying them at all. And they were using their spawn advantage. It didn't matter if STCK lost five players for two players. If they got the correct players, they realized that the defensive spawners are so much longer. They walked back in, as you said, on second. Sammy wasn't up, they just walked forward, and there's so much damage that you lose on that defensive side that it just enabled the, the SDC com SDCK combo to walk forward and just win the round based off of uh, better spawners like that. Yeah, I definitely think the offense from SDCK was impressive in that they were adaptable. Not everything worked for them. They didn't have a successful push every time, but they just tried their hand different things. They would trade when they needed to. They went for dry pushes when they needed to. They went for picks when they needed to. and. There was so much pressure, they were constantly doing something, they constantly had a plan. But the, the real thing for me for SCCK, and the, the reason they won this map, was the space they were able to retake on the defense. There were a couple of times, uh, particularly that, that second round when they were pushed back to third, and they, they had a big spawn wave. They all came out drop down. They just did a committed nine-man push out of drop down. Twice were in a good position. They had the, they had like a decent lockdown on the drop down area, on the slope area. But you know, you're, you're obviously stuck with a couple of players capping the cart. Ended up a nine man STCK repush against maybe five men from twice. STCK just swarmed them, got all the picks they needed, took all the space, had a sentry gun back up within about 30 seconds. It was super, super impressive. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I like. Uh, the early bomb uh, from Jackie Legs, but he doesn't really get anything twice going to play this point. Uh, you know, one thing I see a lot across the pond is that you're going to be walking up on that leave side. Jackie Legs getting in, getting big. Can he find anything? He'll get the force off. And uh, now Ubers will basically be even as Seb has to run away. Garden Fungus see him. No, Mezzo is going to try to gun him down, though. Seb, one health will go down. 
Meza with a 2k, including the med kill, exactly what you need from your uh, spy player. That is a lot of players down for twice, and SDCK back in control. I'm curious to see how they're going to want to hold this. Playing the flank is definitely a strong option right around where Genu is right now. You can put your heavy on the corner and do a lot of work. It's pretty safe from snipers, fairly safe from bombs. But again, this is a dynamic map, and there's no one correct way to play it. I will be uh, seeing how Twice tries to get into this uh, forward hold. Yeah, we saw both snipers going absolutely crazy on that first map, but at the moment it seems like Likey seems to have a bit of an edge, getting broken again there, and they're going to be incredibly crucial on this map if they can find those sidelines, as the Uber's going to be used by SCK here. Likey gets a headshot onto Menex. Um, SCK is so far forward here. Uh, I think, no, not sure if some of the players even realize how far forward they are. Rambosaur getting taken down there. They're being so aggressive that they're almost wrapping around some of the players on the side of twice. And they're just, they're just getting so much more time here. 30 seconds ahead in terms of the round. And that's considering that twice won the mid fight. They've kind of flipped it on its head here. But Seb does have 100% Uber. They're going to use that. They're going to try and take down some players. They get Clark and they get Sandburn. Can they clean up anyone else? It's a bit of a stretch here, Godfather. But they're trying to get aggressive. Oh, Mezzo 3k there. Absolutely gorgeous as Twice gets back in. 130 on the clock. Kedu down. Twice needs to keep their meta alive, but there's really just no threat from SGCK right now. And this should be a cap. Now Jackie Legs going for it. He gets one rocket onto Seb. And he's still lurking behind. Completely blissfully unaware. Should be called right now where he is. Jackie Legs not jumping for the med quite yet as he will heal up a little bit. Oh, Jackie Legs is just such a menace right now. All the way behind, his movement is incredible. He will fall to Rambo, but uh, what a distraction play and getting some spam in onto the medic. SGCK gonna opt to retake this flank with a uh, full combo push, which is, you know, what I like to see, buddy. Taking a lot of space up front. Gedu pretty weak right now, CJ, so he can't really peek to help his combo, but now you were coming in from Sammy getting in. Getting nothing because the beauty of that flank hold is it is so easy to kite and if you don't have a soldier ready to go deep after the uber you are not going to get anything and twice gets nothing oh they kite it so perfectly they're able to repush almost instantly and capture the point for free they don't lose any players they don't use their uber they just back out and walk in again twice just must be wondering how they've managed to just get completely robbed there they've just been mugged they've been pickpocketed somehow by SCCK and they now have 100% uber in the bank they're in the lead by nearly a minute and twice have to decide are they going to go in here for some sacks it's going to be a big bomb Hiver will That's get the force the on to get it buddy leaping buddy? forward oh a buddy in and then out immediately he's going to live for now Axio flying across the point there as he's gone down by Sandburn point remaining in the hands of SGCK twice needs to find something here they have this uber they have time for at least one clean fight probably more but uh it's a question of how they opt to get in Jackie Lakes with an early bomb and getting the force this is absolutely horrendous for twice right now even if they can get their soldier to find some frags he will not even do so twice will get onto the point here but SGCK dropping four happy to back off keep their meta alive keep this ad of about 30 percent and uh, now we're seeing the uh, the ramp, the concrete side, the cliff side hold a lot of different callouts to say there. But uh, rotating back around to leaves, trying to play that angle. Jackie legs up in the air. One rocket, two. Neither hitting the medic, and it is full ad for SDCK to get in and win this first round. Yeah, they just need to execute this, and they're using the Uber. They're trying to clean up some players. They're not getting anyone just yet. Um, in fact, they lose Buddy. Sandburn taking a lot of damage there and twice not giving up standing their ground holding on to this point actually and getting more kills than they're giving away they now have 100% uber and somehow they flipped it completely they just said no to that uber nobody died and they still have control of the point they're going to use this uber now i'm not sure why um not really a force happening they're not going to get anywhere close to getting medics is trying it's going to be hyper bombing in from behind but the rockets don't quite reach i think there's a bit of a misplay there they could have just oh. sat back with the uber but now SCK being invited onto that point 
a nice uh, headshot there. Opens things up. Three down for twice right now. Jackie Legs does go down, but 30 seconds on the clock versus six. The Uber out. Only 50% right now for Seb. Someone's going to have to touch, and Delt isn't going to be healthy enough. Axio also takes it down, and then Sandberg gets the frag onto the Medic. SDCK does get the round. Not as convincingly as I was expecting twice. Certainly putting up a fight, especially early on, and then scrambling for any ground they could. But, uh... That is round one to SDCK here. Yeah, it looked it looked like twice we're just starting to, you know, maybe get a bit of a confidence coming into themselves. But SDCK held for so long and we just saw some really strange Ubers from both teams just that achieved nothing. And then the enemy team just being able to reclaim the point for free. We'll have to see what happens here. But yeah, two rounds away from winning another title as both soldiers go down simultaneously. Um, but it is SDK with more point presence right now. It's only really Rambasaur fighting Broken. towards the point. What an angle he is choosing. He's not even doing it with a head glitch, just taking it aggressively up on that shed. Now looking for the SVS. Does get a kill to start things off. And twice looking to get this mid cap in first. And uh, looks like they're going to get it pretty cleanly, actually. Both Sandburn and Clark both going to go down. Jackie Legs up on that roof. Getting good spam onto the heavy, taking him down. It's four down suddenly for twice. And while they get their first cap, they are certainly losing the mid fight, in my opinion. Actually, just gonna try to take this aggressively. The Uber onto point. Sammy jumping out, and SDCK uh, getting the cap back. Yeah, I mean, there's there's two choices that Twice could have made there. One is to back away with that Uber and regroup, let them have the cap, and then go forward. The other is to do what they did, just go in aggressively, get the Ubers out of the equation, and then fight again, which is what they're trying to do now. Meza with so much pressure onto Sammy, but doesn't actually get the kill. And look at Twice now, they know there's no Ubers in play, they could just go forward, take the DM fights. Uh, unfortunately, they are losing some plays. Three down for them right now, but the entirety of the flank of SCCK is also dead. But look, the cap is going down, and um, they're almost able to get it. No, no, this is Strat there. They are trying to not delay their players as the respawn wave will be longer if they have the point. So uh, opting to delay their engineer but not their scout. The demo jumping forward from SDCK. They also need to be sure to not delay their three spawners right now, especially Sandburn. They're just going to hop off it twice, taking a little space with SDCK not on the point. But now Buddy down as well. The Uber just going to be used in. No demo for this Uber. Jackie Legs needs to be big. It's the stuff from Garden Fungus is kind of keeping this fight alive, but now he goes down and there's not too much here for SDCK. Twice holding on to the point and uh, holding on to their medic as well. Get you dead to the soldier. Yeah, Hiver just bombing in there and manages to get two free rockets onto Gedu. I think that's the first time he's died so far this uh, map. And that's going to be a big advantage for Twice now. They don't have control of the point, but they are in the lead, getting some point pressure. And uh, they have an uber advantage. It's going to be about 50% by the time that Gedu starts healing. So this is kind of they've got all their pieces in position this is kind of like you know mate in however many moves if they just play this sensibly they don't let go of the point they protect their medic this could be a round on the board for them and this could be you know them chalking up some points in this grand final but you know there's a lot more a lot more to do than just sitting back and waiting for stuff to happen no, this is one of those maps where you cannot just sit and have the players come to you. I, in my opinion, holding aggressively and taking fights to the enemy is uh, the best way to play this map. It's something I found success for with my team, just going in deep. Broken's going to pick up May with a nice clean snipe. There is the Uber and the drop on, to, or not the drop, just the med kill. Axio killing Gedu. And uh, twice have taken two minutes off this clock almost already, and it's only down their heavy. They are looking good in round number two, CJ. That is absolutely huge. Like I said, they just need to play their cards right and things will go well for them. But Axio getting the medic kill there is huge. Now, again, they have an uber advantage. Not as big as about 30% and they are a couple of players down. And SCCK are going to know that. They're going to try to abuse that fact and get some point pressure while there's some you know heavy hitters down. Broken, though, gets Likey down. He's on a six kill streak right now. He's absolutely been popping off this second round. And uh, there's a lot of pressure on this. They get the cap, but, you know, they, they just reset the spawns of Likey, Mezzo, and uh, Sammy is dead. But I think Twice just want to keep fighting this because it's in their best interest to do it. They still have an Uber. Still have an Uber. SCTK pretty close to their own. 40 seconds on the clock for Twice right now. Down two, almost down three there. Their heavy got pretty weak, but broken. Absolutely popping off right here as Ubers equalize. 
The cap comes through, it's gonna be an aggressive Uber from Buddy. He's jumping deep, no help from his team though on this. And he's getting absolutely nothing. In fact, his players are uh, dropping, actually both teams dropping a few as uh, the point will go back. And I'm just looking to see how Twice gets back in. Yeah, they have this full Uber ad set at 100% Uber. Um, so if they can just go in here, just try to, you know, have a clinical push. If they manage to do that, then you know what? There's not much time left on the point for them. They're going in now, and uh, SCCK respecting it. The Uber comes in. They're trying to chase Garden Fungus with the M2, just pushing them away. Axio does manage to get two. He gets Buddy and Likey. That's absolutely Axio. huge. A lot of plays for SCK falling by the wayside as well. 25 seconds left on the cap now as twice have claimed control. Gedu lives though, Godfather. That is going to be the one lifeline SCK have for this round. If they manage to go forward with an Uber to try and get something done, but they do not have much time to play with 10 seconds left on the clock. 10 seconds and a dream for SDCK to go two up here in map number two. Axios gonna pick up May, the Uber's gonna be popped in. Who's gonna be touching though? Looks like Guard Fungus is on it. Clark doing his best to help out killing this heavy. He'll die for it. Phoenix is on a 5k, still alive, dancing around. Oh no, the destruction on Tegedu. Sammy's gonna pick him up and now broken hitting shots as well. Twice in overtime right now. Jackie Lex for the hero play, can't find it. Menek 6k and around to twice. They're going to square it up one to one on this second map. And I did call it before the map. You know, I didn't say I could see a round coming out of them here. You know, this is something that has happened for forever in TF2. When there is a team that is, you know, the underdog coming into a final, into a playoff game, they will often pick a map like Steel that's a little bit more, you know, chaotic, um, or a map that is, you know, slightly unknown. You know, UGC when it had Swiftwater and stuff like that. And Proot is a new map oh, over here. What but a Seth shot! Like what with the headshot. Hot CJ, that is nasty from Likey to open things up. No Seb on the field. Here's a bomb though, trying to get on to Gedu. Oh, good surf away. We'll keep him alive for now at least. There surely will be a threat coming in. No heals for this medic. The NG trying to sack for him. That is a full wipe on the mid. SDCK coming back with a vengeance. And we'll get that mid fight win very cleanly all off that opening pick from Likey taking down the medic. And, uh, wow, CJ, I mean, to, to lose a round, drop a round like that, and come back with such an aggressive and clean mid-fight, SCCK showing uh, why they are one of, if not the best teams in European TF2. I mean, yeah, it, it's really painful when you kind of think we're back into this map, and then you lose your medic that early on into the mid-fight. Uh, SCCK showing that uh, it's definitely uh, not going to be rolling over here. They do use the Uber. Seb manages to surf away and survive. They do stop the cap from going down there, which is pretty big because it's just going to get more and more time for them. They've lost a number of players. And I think this is where things start to you know, unwind for SCCK a little bit because they're trying to get aggressive, but Jackie Lex is in. It doesn't matter. Ignore Dude, what I just said. When you've got a man that can just jump in and get your medic and demo like that, it doesn't matter. It's Jackie Lex's world. It just is. It's his world and everyone else is playing in it. He has turned it on for map number two. I, I think, I wouldn't say that he struggled map one, but he certainly wasn't shining like the star that he is. And now, I mean, SDCK needs him to be big here on a cough map, and he is so far been just that. Axio looking for a decloak on Cliff. Can he find And He's not decloaking quite yet. He's twice edging the point a little bit. That's why just lurking in the background could come in clutch here for twice. He's going... Please decloak already, Axio. No, he's going to run away instead as uh, SDCK holding on to this point with that full Uber. Yeah, they're looking a lot stronger here. I mean, I was just saying before all of that happened is Jackie is again Axio. onto Sebastian. Axio gets two. Can he get on to get him? He'll just get the force out, actually. No Uber in hand for SDCK. Twice does have their soldier behind. He'll uh, not find too much. But a few more dropping for SDZK right now and twice looking to get back in. Yeah, they have full Uber and they're probably going to get the cap here. Um, it just turns in a bit chaotic. And I think the chaos at the moment is definitely favoring twice. When things like this happen, they're just coming out on top with, you know, slightly more players during the confusion. And again, maybe it's the fact that it's a slightly newer map that... Uh, SCCK aren't quite as cohesive and glued together as they wouldn't be normally on other maps. Um, twice though are behind by about a minute. Hiver into the skybox, playing down some damage. 
Um, Jackie trying to clear up the sentry on the point, maybe going for a bomb, but during all of that, Godfather, Getty, Getty went down. Uh, and Seb's actually going to die in the post. Jackie Legs will come in and clean up that kill onto the medic. So neither med lives through the fight, but twice in control of the point. Not for long, it seems like, as STCK want to get back in here. They have the heals, they have the spawners. Faster spawn wave again, because twice has the point. Shouldn't delay Garden Fungus here. It would be a bit of a misplay. I want to see them hop off the point now. Don't delay, and that is from two seconds to nine seconds, and now they're going to lose two more here. So twice up four players against STCK. That's just not what I want to see. What I do see, though, is Kritzkrieg, Kritzkrieg excuse me, coming up for twice, and they will certainly have their Uber before STCK, and they'll have the point here in a moment as well, not delaying their players, now getting the cap, and uh, twice. You know, it's CJ, in my opinion, it's the little mistakes that add up, and STCK, if they keep making those little mistakes, they keep delaying their players like that, it will add up. And Jackie Lex can go as big as he wants, but uh, there's always a heavy waiting for him there. And uh, twice back in control of this map. Absolutely. You talk about the little mistakes. That's what's happening, and that's why this round has been so close. Two players down for twice. They have the Uber. They're deciding not to use it, just backing away. And they're it's giving the that cap up. Oh, it's a crit, and yeah, it's a Chris it's a Pyro. Crit. They got no one to use it on. The laser beams across the point, maybe, but they're just going to gun down Seb. And uh, that is not how you use a crit. you got to take so much more space, get in so much deeper. And it results in a med tap and 30 seconds on the clock for SDCK with 50% Uber. They'll probably have in time for this round to go into overtime. Twice really need to get it back into gear here. Uh, they've got their players. Looks like they're playing this cliffside, bringing their sniper and their medic, really committing to it as uh, SCCK holding onto the flank, a hold I really like. Yeah, I mean, 10 seconds left on the clock. It's a big, big ask for twice here. Uh, they've got nothing to work with, and they have an Uber to face. As it's going to be used there, and uh, it's going to be Buddy cleaning house. Gets one, get two. They're backing right to the point now. It is going to be a bit chaotic on the point. A lot of players dying, but the ones who are on the side of twice are so very weak. Wow. And they're all going to die. We're going to see Buddy just finish that round off with a taunt. It's going to 2-1 now on this second map, and SCCK are one round away from winning the map the oh, series and the championship th or first to three it i is, forgot it in is. north america we play uh first to four here uh and uh quick shout out to uh the five gifted i think that was from uh who was it axio no it wasn't axio it couldn't be Axio. nixon uh i will flex later i assure you uh back when we have our cams but we are in another mid fight here cj take us through it we're seeing twice just backs into a corner here. They've just got no space to work with. SCCK in just complete control. They're able to just walk onto the point for free. There's no one defending it. Axio goes in, gets Likey, uh, but that's pretty much going to be the only kill they're going to get. And they get the cap. They back away here, just inviting them onto the point. Sandburn hiding. Not able to get a kill, though. Um, but a very weird mid fight here. It's going to be used by twice. Getting still has 95%, uh, not quite there yet. Um, and the points get traded back and forth. The Ubers are going to be used now, Godfather. Buddy is in really deep. Broken goes down, but I think we're going to settle down and the cab's going to go back to SCCK. Yeah, I think SCCK is very happy to... Uh, I delayed Jackie, come on. I uh, can't be doing that time and time again. I, I think SCCK is happy to have twice uh, get the first cap as long as they can actually win the mid fight. Um, and that's what they've done twice now. Uh, and it's going to be twice coming up on the cliff angle. Uh, cliff into holding main and, and playing around this main uh, shed. Don't think it's as good. They're going to rotate to play main to main and it's just going to be spam across the right side of the point. Gedu though is taken down by a body shot from Broken. So uh, peeking the wrong angle and Getting punished very quickly. Full ad for twice. Yes, slim mistake there, but it's absolutely massive in the uh, the realms of the game because you say, look, the cleanup is happening for twice. SCK just being taken out and sent back to the respawn queue, just waiting on that cap a little bit longer before finalizing it. Um, they are a minute behind, but they do have a slim advantage. Set going very, very weak there. And honestly, Godfather, this Uber ad isn't really too much to write home about. We're talking like. 20% nah, maybe? 
let's barely add and it should just even out before twice takes it aggressively broken on a 4k he's coming into his own here seb has to be careful he is narrowly dodging a lot of damage right now like he does take down delts it's a pick class map right now jackie like so will win the soldier v soldier and broken gets his fifth again you can just you cannot peek a sniper like that. The cap going. Stop to. I'm getting frustrated by SDCK delaying their players uh, time and time again. Just wait. It's not worth it. I think at this point in time, they're happy to just get the cap, get the time, knowing that they can hold without Garden Fungus there. There's a teleporter that's going to get him back in time. I think they realize that twice aren't throwing caution to the wind quite yet. Um, we're going to have an Uber trade here on point, but it's so much better for the blue side. SCK on the chase, maybe trying to get some damage. Sammy does go down, but it's basically a trade. His buddy also dies, but then a lot of kills coming in from the flank. Axio, Menex all going down. It's a little bit chaotic. We're in a 5v5 right now. Um, the respawns are going to favor twice, and that's why they're getting onto the cap. But Clark is in. Doesn't manage to get the medic, but it's enough to make them turn around at least. Uh, but they do get the cap here. They're over a minute behind. Um, but SCK just kind of just... Going forward, it, broken with the 6k. Broken is just keeping Sniper twice might be a little here. broken, you know? <laughs> hey. uh, if, if I were to say something about it, uh, shout out Donnie2002 for the sub. Much appreciated as this uh, fight continues. Jackie Legs jumps forward, jumps back out. And uh, SGCK taking space here. Don't want to see them dropping many players. The Uber is going to be used in aggressively by twice. Need to get their medic out of the way. Uh, Gedu, nowhere to be found for this Uber. Now 90% for SDCK, ready to get back in. Only 60 seconds on the clock for SDCK to take this one home. The question is, can Twice hold off the onslaught that will be this SDCK Uber? I mean, there's 59 seconds between SDCK and another Prem title, and uh, it's only Twice in the way. They just have to hold on to this. Um, the question is, do they let this cap go down? The Uber's gonna come in, buddy, with the big jump and Likey! He's the one that gets the med pick. Buddy getting the kills everywhere else on the server, but that med going down is almost like the second nail in the coffin here. It's gonna be really hard for them to get back into this Godfather. There's still 45 seconds left, and it's gonna be like a 30% add at most. Uh, but twice really, 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 really need to take some risks now and just go forward and start winning some fights. Actually, he's going to pick up Likey so you don't have to worry about a sniper as you try to repush. Or I'm surprised to not be seeing crits from twice. They favored it in these desperate situations. Now working their way forward, trying to spam in to that flank area. Just having no luck so far. Sending a soldier forward. He gets denied pretty hard. Two down for SDCK. Now is kind of the time to go. But they're just taking their sweet time when they don't have any time to do anything here. Axio, he's going for a play. Right now, looking for the stab onto Buddy. Gonna get him there. And now, the soldier also jumping forward. Overtime will be in play. The Uber coming out. It's only 85 for twice. STCK looking to close it out here. Sab going very weak. He's gonna... Oh, he gets the Uber just in time. And will live twice. We'll get back onto the point. And not delaying their players. Right, guys? Uh, good play there. Keeping Axio... Uh, up on time. Broken going to die though to Mezzo Stab. And they're going to go for the cap now. Oh, Jackie Legs though. Just as things were going so well for them, Jackie Legs comes in and gets Sebastian -y. That is going to be Medic down. And now twice have to hold on to this point with no heals, no demo, no sniper. And SCK realized that they smell the blood in the water. They're just going to flood onto the point. Menex dealt. Hive are all going down. And it's going to be the round for SCK. They take. The second map, three to one. They're going to take the series 2-0. And that is another grand final victory. Another championship win. And their 14th ETF2L title.